The Middle Rio Grande, an urban water site, is located in Albuquerque, New Mexico. The Rio Grande is over 1,900 miles long, running from its headwaters in the San Juan Mountains near Creed, Colorado, and flowing into the Gulf of Mexico. Today, the watershed faces many challenges, such as balancing a finite water supply and dealing with long-term drought exacerbated by climate change. The Department of Housing and Urban Development and the Environmental Protection Agency are leading efforts to improve the Middle Rio Grande watershed. This is an interesting location because the river is essentially what's bringing us here. And the city of Albuquerque and the county of Bernalillo are actually sandwiched between two tribes. And so you have the Sandia tribe, or Pueblo Sandia, which is on the north end of Albuquerque. And then you have the Isleta Pueblo, which is on the southern end of the Middle Rio Grande. Through the partnership, many efforts are underway to transform the waterway and drive urban revitalization. Among the most noteworthy, the creation of the nation's first urban national wildlife refuge in the southwest. It's actually, you know, um, the vision of the Fish and Wildlife Service. You know, they essentially, there's this parcel of land, it used to be a dairy farm. And, um, and so they became interested in it because of the habitat that was coming through this area just naturally. It is the first urban refuge designated by the Department of Interior. A second project is looking to redevelop the Bridge Boulevard corridor. This corridor is being transformed from an unsafe roadway to a walkable, community-oriented meeting place. To come up with a redevelopment plan for Bridge Boulevard, which is an east-west crossing over the river that intersects at 2nd Street, uh, which is the north-south road that runs down to the refuge. And so Bernalillo County received this grant, it was a half a million dollars, to put together this plan. And they spent almost two years meeting with all of the neighborhood associations, uh, doing surveys, going door to door, having charrettes to come up with a way to address a corridor that had become tremendously unsafe. The Bridge Boulevard project will reduce traffic congestion, revitalize neighborhood businesses, and manage environmental impacts. High priority has also been placed on community engagement. The intent is to begin the catalyst and get the community to see that through networking of not just one type of group or one type of theme, that you can actually get a whole lot of different things accomplished that actually will have merit not just for individual groups but for the community at large. And so I think that's probably the biggest thing that I hope occurs in this community. This particular partnership, uh, the, the biggest accomplishment I think that we've had so far has been introducing people to each other. And so my hope is that a few years from now, the entire community, everybody who lives in the watershed will understand that they live in the Middle Rio Grande watershed and what that means and how they can be good stewards of their water source.